Hi guys, welcome back. A little bit of a different setup here today. I get so many questions on my Lazy Susan and my mandalas that I figured I would try to do one today for you. So I have my canvas here, has been taped off on top of my dirty Lazy Susan. Just a plain old Lazy Susan I found at Goodwill. So first I'm going to just cover this with white paint. Now it doesn't need to be a lot of white paint, I just get enough paint on here so when I start spinning and moving the rest of the paint, it'll glide easier. There's not any leftover bare spots if your paint does not stretch all the way. I'm just future proofing a little, okay. Next I'm going to use this little strainer. I got it, I think, from Ace or from Walmart, just in the regular um, strainer section for any of uh, your sinks or whatever. What I like to do first get the hair off. to spin it to see if it's in a uh, central location and then I like to put down my spinner and give it a little spin and see if it's wobbly that one's obviously wobbly There we go. Just so when I spin it, this design stays in the center and it looks like it's not wobbling or moving anywhere. Okay. So we're going to do this two separate ways. I'm going to take my paint and I'm going to pour it directly into the circle. Second way I'm going to do it is with this little dish. I'm going to dirty pour into the middle. So I'm going to have my cup over here on the side, and I'm going to start spinning.
So I can tell the paint hasn't reached the edges yet, but it looks like it's a really nice design. So I'm gonna do it just a little bit more. I'm going to keep spinning. You want to lift that up? So you can see, there we go. Maybe you can't, there you go. <laughs> a little off centered over here, but that's okay. I still think this is a beautiful design. I love the colors here. And then if you saw, I just go right outside of the um, strap, just carry my hand out to make that swirl pattern. Just wanted to show you guys some different techniques with how to do these mandalas. I hope you found some stuff interesting here or learned a few things. If you did, give this a thumbs up. Subscribe and come back and see what I do next. I really appreciate you watching. Have a great day.